taking two steps. You know, first, look, we've already lost his voice, and, and uh, it's been many months now since he's been since, since he was last able to participate, and that's slowed things down. Um, we are going to have an election in Massachusetts. Not, that's not in question. And we're going to have as quick an election as you can have. We've got a very good election administrator, our Secretary of State, Bill Galvin. We will have a clean, honest, open, fast election. But there is a question as to what you do in the interim. And, I, you know, we need to stress this. The debate is not whether you appoint or elect. Given, an election to given, it is what do you do during the interim period? And I think it makes absolute sense to have someone appointed who will have promised not to run again. You cannot, I think, constitutionally enforce that legally. But I believe you can easily find someone who will say, yes, I'll serve for these months, I will vote. And that's going to look especially important since the uh, uh, Republicans have announced that they're going to require, uh, if they can, 60 votes. Uh, we're not talking about uh, you know, even getting a majority in the Senate, but getting an extraordinary majority. So I believe that it's perfectly consistent with Democratic principles. We're going to have an election as quickly as possible. The only question is, what do you do during that vacant period? And I think we will have an appointee who will not himself or herself be a candidate.